The jam is good. We're good with the jam. You might say it's your jam. Welcome to Royal Roundtable. I'm Page Six Style Editor Alana. And I'm Senior Director of Social Media and Audience Engagement, Kristen. It's been a major week for Meghan Markle fans. After announcing the launch of her lifestyle brand, American Riviera Orchard, in March, the Duchess of Sussex appears to have unveiled the line's first product, small batch strawberry jam, jars of which were recently sent out to some of her high profile friends. Just look at that tasteful packaging. And Megan's been leading into quiet luxury with her outfits lately as well, having just wrapped up a trip to Wellington, Florida for the Royal Salute Polo Challenge to benefit Santa Bali, the charity Prince Harry co-founded in 2006. To cheer on Harry as he played in the match itself, the Duchess wore an ivory Heidi Merrick halter dress tied with a beautiful bow and accessorized with a pair of oversized sunglasses from the brand, along with vintage Chanel earrings, a Valentino bag, and Aquazora pumps. I was swooning over the earrings, Alana. I need those earrings desperately. But fans on social media couldn't help but spot what seemed to be a nod to Prince Harry in the dress's style name. It's called the Ginger. Sound like a certain royal redhead? Whether or not it was a coincidence, I personally loved that. My only question is, will we be getting Meghan Markle designed clothes or just fruit spreads and silverware? Well, as a source told Page Six on the day of the launch, American Riviera Orchard will focus on, quote, all the things that are close to her heart. And judging by how often she covered fashion on the TIG, I'd say it definitely qualifies. What do you guys want to see from the brand, though? Drop your suggestions in the comments. We want to see them. It's just jam, though, Alana. Like, if there's just jam, I'm buying it, so. The jam is good, we're good with the jam. You might say it's your jam. Jam is my jam. Thanks, Megan.